Hey guys, welcome. So today is July 29. We got back from our Yellowstone trip yesterday. Oh, see, I already shaved. And today, I'm gonna pick up my Altor 9mm pistol that was sent to me by their CEO, I think that he is also the inventor. I have to check, but I saw I saw him uh, on a YouTube video and we were exchanging correspondence. And I was touched because he said that uh, he will support me. Uh, he, he, he likes to support small channels, uh, small companies like him, since uh, Altor is just a small company. Because initially I, I, uh, I told him that I'm not as big as the other gun channels, but I have uh, gun videos. Majority of my, my videos are gun videos. I just, I'm just mixing it up. So uh, it keeps me under the radar of YouTube. So, you know, that's how I survive. Anyway, so uh, like I said, I really appreciate his support. I can purchase his firearm. It's, it's a cheap cheap pistol but it really means a lot when it is given to you you know as a support to your channel to your cause to what you do okay so it's very fitting that I grabbed this shirt okay <laughs> I was wearing a uh, home clothes uh, a while ago and then I just grabbed this yeah support for uh, American company and the second amendment thank you Alter so let's pick it up when I got home, I showed this to my my kids and my wife. Their initial reaction is, what is that? They are familiar with firearms, but when they saw this, they said, what is that? Okay, so it's in the box. This is the, the manual. Okay. Very good illustrations. It's there, you know, because this is a unique firearm, so... You have to know how it operates. There you go. And this is the actual gun. It comes with a small lock. And this is the firearm. So this is 9mm. It comes in two calibers, 380 and 9mm. So this is the 9 version. Okay. Oh, let's put it in white. Uh, Okay, so when he opened the package, he asked me, why did you buy this gun? So I said, uh, sorry for the term, but when I saw it, I said, it, it, it's so ugly that I have to have it, okay? It, it has a place in my budget gun collection. Plus, plus, uh, guns like this has a special place in the arsenals of preppers. Okay, so they are marketing this uh, for vets, uh, veterinarians to, you know, to use when they need to put down an animal. But how, how many times does that happen, you know, compared to preppers? Because these things are so cheap, you can buy a couple and then spread it out in your property or put it in your bug out bag and forget about it. Okay. And this has, I don't, uh, I think five pieces. I have to check that. Few uh, moving parts that it is very reliable. Okay, so let's look at the gun. Look at the, the barrel, the shape, and goes the corresponding shape of the receiver. I don't know. Okay, this it. And it says right now it's on safe. You pull the little, the trigger and twist it. Now it's on fire. So the way you fire it is very simple. It's it's not your usual trigger system. Hold the gun and you pull the trigger, okay, it doesn't fire, why? Because of the cross safety. 
By the way, I'm wearing gloves because uh, my hands are dirty. I've been doing some uh, uh, garage work. So this is the crossbow safety. Similar to other guns or shotguns. Red is dead. Okay, now you can pull the trigger. So it does not have that break that you're looking for. You need to reach this uh, part right here to let go of the trigger. That's how you fire it, okay? That's how you fire it. It says nine millimeter. Okay, that's how you fire it. And how you load it, pull the trigger back a bit, twist it, and get a round. So this is a nine millimeter, safe direction. Pull the trigger a little bit so you can slide it. There you go. I don't know if this is going to fire in this kind of configuration without the barrel. I have to check that out uh, in the range. So insert, pull the trigger a bit. There you go. It's on fire. Pull the trigger a bit. That's on safe. So that's on safe. Crossbolt safety. There you go. Um, let's remove the round. Pull it back. The sights are all black, so easy mod is just painted with uh, nail polish, probably white or orange, and that's it. So my friend told me that it looks like a torch uh, that, that you use for cooking. Yeah, it can be, and it looks like a glue gun. Okay. So, like I said, um, if we're up, if it were up to me, they will they should market this for preppers because you know they it, it's uh, cheap and reliable. Has a uh, few mo moving parts. Less likely that something may um, may go wrong, and uh, it's cheap. Okay. So you, you can book, buy a couple, put it in a bug out bag, forget about it. Put it in your uh, toolbox, forget about it. Okay. So that's it. This is my initial impression of the Altor 9mm. It's a very good quality gun, very unique, very unique and yet look at the quality of the materials used especially with the barrel I don't know how you can tell but this barrel is so thick and has a good weight to it so that's it this is my initial impression for the Altor 9mm and also yeah don't forget my future shooting videos of this gun and my other guns. Thanks for watching.